feel like if I had been closeted like three more years, I could have been into football for the rest of my life. I'm shocked you aren't <laughs> as it. Hello, I'm Jay Jordan. Welcome to The Vulture Spot, here with the voices behind Stradio Lab, Sam and George. How are y'all doing? Wow. Oh, incredible. This is our first time revealing our faces ever <laughs> to the press. Look, look. Hi, Good this faces. is what we look like. Yeah, we were told by a consultant that our faces are too symmetrical to be on camera, so that's why we chose podcasting. Yeah, it takes people out of it, out of the realism. It's y'all's cross the bear. Yeah, yeah. and yeah. It's, we were told, you know, it's not, obviously with the body positivity movement, to see such perfect <laughs> specimen on camera would be distracting and actually bad for democracy. Yeah, I mean, we've met so many casting directors mm -hmm. even, and they were like, I wish I could, but yeah. people are gonna riot. People are not into classic beauty anymore. <laughs> it's so sad. If only it was the 20s. <laughs> it's strange, you know, because we, we don't have, to, I don't want it to be the 20s. I don't want it, to, I, I famously do not want it to be the 20s. Thank y'all for bringing in drinks. No one else has brought in drinks. Well, no one else is an alcoholic. <laughs> <laughs> No, to be fair, we have no idea what we're doing at any time and just sort of wandering around. Yeah, as long as we're drinking. I love the ASMR of the ice rattling. Okay, so I do have to ask, because you're the first queer people to ever do it, what is a podcast? Wow. Oh. <laughs> I mean, that is such a question, Jay. Okay. That is very difficult for us to even hear. It's right here. What is yeah. a podcast? George, kick us off. It's something that I feel uncomfortable even verbalizing. Oh. <laughs> unless it's behind a paywall. <laughs> um, we have always thought, you know, oral storytelling traditions, this is something we kind of came up with, mm -hmm. are the okay. oldest form of storytelling. Yeah. And so we thought, what if we made that accessible to the public? All right. Via a, a feed yes. hosted by Apple. Okay. Yeah, yeah. I remember George had the idea to put it on Apple, and I said, George, you have done it again. Yeah. Well, well, Sam kept saying, you know, there are so many other companies, but I said, but Apple has, a podcast app. Yeah, I was like, maybe we could sort of submit it to Best Buy, drop off CDs, yeah. and George yeah. said, no, there's actually this brand new website called Apple that you should really check the, out. The, the Apple website. Apple.com. Yeah. Apple it was interesting because Sam kept talking about CDs, cassettes. <laughs> this was in 2019, mind you. So An old soul. It, yeah, it, always. Yeah, yeah. he's very kind of Zoe Deschanel in that way. He's always wearing a bonnet. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> um, His kids speak Italian. Yeah. You we, don't? <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay. I do have to ask you because Stradio Lab is about straight culture, which we accept, love, and it will continue to thrive. It's beautiful. Yes, inevitably. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, what is the straightest thing that you two have done this week? That is uh, a great question. I texted George today saying, Do you want to get in and out for lunch? That's pretty straight. Very straight. And, and he responded, He called me in and said, I can't have a lunch that's that heavy. And well, I, said, I said- Which is yeah. not straight at all. No. no. Which is no, quite I, the you opposite. Don't forget who you are. Sam, I have to say, Sam's personality is kind of like, if you let him straight too far, he will become straight. <laughs> and then I have to be, step in and right. be like, no, 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 no. Okay. You know, put that baseball bat down. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm always trying to play. Okay, what is, what's the straightest thing you did this week, George? You know, I, I'm in the process of coordinating my parents visiting me for Thanksgiving in order to host a kind of family Thanksgiving, not a Friendsgiving. There's no chosen family at all. Okay. It's bio only. All right, it went, it was yeah. going to a very queer space with yes. the word coordinate. Yes. Well, I know when I said the word mother, you were like, yes. <laughs> <laughs> but I did actually mean my biological mother. Yes, 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 all right, all right, all right. So biocentralism puts it exactly. back in the straight exactly. place. Okay, cool, that's wonderful. I sadly was obsessed with a college football game earlier this afternoon, so I too- We did hear that. Yeah. You mentioned you might be bringing that up and we both kind of, it was blank, blank in our brain. I felt the judgment, but also just sort of the ignorance about the subject. Judgment is an interesting word. I actually more so felt like you were doming us by saying you were, yeah. you knew about football uh, and we did it. There are queer people who like American football. Uh. Yeah. No, don't make, no, no, no. And they're, they're good people. I'm not one of them, I'm terrible, I'm evil, but there are good queer people who like football. Sure, sure. I mean, I would watch football if, if women tennis players were paid the same as Tom Brady. Activism. I would watch. <laughs>